Hey everyone, it's Dan again. If you've been watching these exposed videos, you've probably noticed that the user interface that I've been in looks a little different than what you're used to seeing in On One Photo. One of the things we're working on for the future is an updated user interface. It's a little more modern and more clean. It really focuses more on the photos that you're working on. You notice that a lot of the key lines that go around borders are gone. The grays are a softer gray now. The font is a little bit easier to read. And the accent color is now orange, but you can actually choose whatever accent color you want. You can go to the preferences, and under accent color, you can select from a range of different colors. You can even pick a silver option if you don't want any color in your user interface. One of the other things that's changed in the user interface that I really love are the sliders. Let's just go to develop so you can take a look at one. You notice that with the sliders, they're longer than they used to be. This allows them to be more precise. The label now sits on top of it rather than to the left. So you can make a more precise adjustment. It also allows you to take each of the columns, the left and the right drawers, and you can make those wider or more narrow than they used to be so that you have more room for your photo. We've also simplified the organization on the bumpers on the left and the right hand side, making it easier to get to the most common stuff. These changes also make it work better on smaller displays or on tablets with touch screen displays like Microsoft Surface tablets. I really love the new look. It's amazing how these subtle changes can make it feel so new. Thanks for watching.